Hey hey and welcome back to Colored Creations. Today I'm going to show you how I made my sketchbook based off the tutorial made by Sea Lemon. I will leave a card so you can pop over and see the full version of this tutorial. I decided to use different kinds of paper to give me a variation to work on and I used my usual drawing paper, marker friendly paper, craft paper, black paper and watercolor paper. I started by folding all of my papers and then adding a strip of duct tape to both sides of the outer pages of each signature. A signature is a pile of paper and each signature consists of four papers. Since I don't have a fancy book press, I simply just put a crockpot on top of the signatures for a while so the signatures could become more flat again since the duct tape added quite a bit of bulk. Then I used one of the papers as a template to measure the size of the cover. I used the cardboard from the backing of I used a half paper pad. After that I put overlapping duct tape all over the covers on both sides and then I cut out some decorative dots in a contrasting color to make the co cover a bit more fun. I also added some holes on the back side um, and an elastic so I could keep my sketchbook closed. Next up is making the holes for the stitching, and I used a nail and a hammer since I don't have an awl. The first page gets used as a template for the rest of the signatures and the cover. Then I moved on to the sewing part, and I'm just going to refer you to Sea Lemon's channel to get a proper explanation of how to do Coptic stitching, but it's really not that hard and it's actually quite therapeutic to do. I used waxed cotton thread for my stitching, and it has held up really well. And when your book is finished, you can simply just bring your furry body out to a beautiful scenery, toss out a handful of kibbles and paint in your new book. I hope you enjoyed this video, and as I said in the beginning, the full tutorial can be seen over at Sea Lemon's channel. This is just a shorter version of how I made my sketch. I hope you have a lovely day, and I'll see you in my next video. Idoa!